Okay, well, let's begin. So again, welcome back to the Wolf Among Us. Today we'll be playing episode 4, uh, Cry Wolf. And uh, judging by the... I, I literally just now noticed the hands. That is so awesome, I love that. Okay, yeah, I'm literally just starting, I can't wait. <clears throat> I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Yep, Faith, and we killed uh, Tweedledum, I, I think, it. not D. Not if I can avoid it, yep, yep. This is where it all began. The head on the stairs. <laughs> Holly's sister, Lily. I just don't know what Bigby's doing. If he, if he cares about it, if he even gives a shit. Yeah, I remember this emotional That's scene. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? We're destroying the tree. No. Yeah, I chose not to. We're not burning the tree, Snow. Hey. You're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? Of course not. You're like my know. best friend, Colin. She'll come around. She's just... You know, the crane thing hit her hard, and she doesn't really know who her friends are right now. Oh, God! Bigby! Silver bullets. This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Bigby, wait. When you get the Crooked Man, <clears throat> be sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. Okay, so... Right, it's literally just the recap of the past four episodes and then just straight off to intro. That is where we left it off. We finally met the Crooked Man. And he honestly didn't leave me the impression to be the villain that he was laid out to be. It's more like a vigilante, if you know what I mean. It's kind of how I feel him. God, I love this intro so much. I'm really gonna miss it until it's 2019 and Season 2 comes out. <clears throat> Episode 5 Cry Wolf You've come a long way You is must he, be tired Is he British? He sounds British Crooked Man's Lair, Night And if my envoys are correct You haven't had a lot of rest recently well, not exactly, no. Especially this guy. Please, Sheriff. <clears throat> relax for a moment, will you? God, I hate Don't when people drink. say that. Like, so I can't, it. okay? Leave me alone. Vivian makes a very nice, very... It's elegant. Really, a carpaccio. It's De lobster. Despacito? Sirloin. Oh my god, Lester, no. I'm gonna oh, have a drink. Gramercy me. Take a seat at the very least. Got a scotch? Only Tennessee whiskey, unfortunately. What do you think you're doing? He's gonna. Mr. Wolf is our guest, and I have every intention of cooperating. So don't waste the silver. Hey, Sean Toby, welcome Jersey. to Simstram, and Joe, welcome back. Well, Sheriff, for the sake of transparency, why don't you tell us why you're here? It would help settle everyone's nerves, I think. You know why I'm here. That's kind of the Killed main thing, women. yeah. What women? Faith and Lily, the girls who worked at the Pudding and Pie. Did I now? I assume by your confidence in accusing me, you must have some proof of this, yes? Some allotment of evidence. A witness, perhaps. Hmm? I know you did it. 
I'm sorry, Sheriff. I wish you had me dead to rights. I really do, for your own sake. But no, I didn't kill anyone. Those women. I don't relish telling you that the killings were perpetrated by an employee of mine. It's a very unfortunate bit of business, but I promise you that the matter will be dealt with internally. I just want to settle the issue for you, and to assure you that it's over with. You really don't need to worry yourself. So he's playing kind of a passive aggressive card. An unfortunate bit of business. And I'm sorry, You're but tell me right now who killed him. You cannot Sheriff, deal with it internally, not anymore. For you and your job. I hope you know that. But I simply can't divulge that information. I genuinely you don't really know who killed them. Worry yourself. As I said, I've got this under control. It wasn't Crane no, and we thought it was I'm him. Gonna deal with it right because now. they owe yeah, him right. money and whatever. What do you think this is? Some kind of negotiation. Do you want to join the your brother? Man said he'd take care of it. So why don't you take the hint and get out? Tweedledee, please. I'm I mean, the law here, not you. I now hate tell that me who saying, did it. but yeah, what? it's true. You're gonna kill me too. Well, yeah. Go ahead. You think I give a shit anymore after what you did? That's enough. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but. In the interest of preserving our alliance. Alliance? If you have to know, it was Georgie. Really? However, like I said, I'd be handling the matter if you don't mind. Georgie. You got what you wanted, so just sit Why would he kill his own now. personnel? I don't get it. It doesn't sound right. Nothing pointed towards him. Yeah, I killed him, so what? You should have just kept your nose where it Why? fucking belonged. Why'd you do it? Why kill them? Does it matter? Look, the fact is, George here misinterpreted one of my instructions. Misinterpreted? And I want to make things right. So, let's work something out. What's there to work out? I'm protected, aren't I? Your protection has limits, and I think you've far exceeded yours. But you could murder someone in cold blood like that. You fucking asked me to do this. And then you told attempt me to, to kill blame him. me for it. You will okay. be silent while we discuss what to do with you. His organization is, like is, is falling apart. <laughs> You're just gonna let him do this. So what do you say, Sheriff? Can we discuss terms? You can have Georgie. Consider it a gift. Ensuring our continued cooperation. What the hell? Take this fucker. Take all of them. I didn't fucking Don't start make this. Any trouble, Georgie? Okay, you yeah, seriously yeah. throwing me under the fucking carriage? I think I'll be taking both of you. You're not taking me, you fucking ponce. What the fuck is you this? You fucking ponce. You said you'd cover for us. For minor infractions, not murder. Just go with them, Georgie. You're gonna sink us all. What's wrong with you people? You're really gonna sell him out just like you that? You think I give a fuck if I'm the one? Who the shit do you think you fuckers are out the fuck out of here? It's all falling apart. But I think it's best if you leave now. There's no way I'm going with him. Are you kidding me? Things are about to get unpleasant, and I would rather you weren't here to watch. You can go join that whore at the bottom of the lake for all I give a shit. But he's not taking me anywhere. I'll roll over on the lot of you before I let that shit happen. What are you saying? Yeah, what the fuck? You're gonna make sure we all go down this shitter with you? I told you. I'm running out of patience, crooked man. I don't have time to fuck around here. This could have gone so well. Hey, Foxy, welcome to Stram and M. You just had to complicate. And yeah, Taito, I mean that's, but it, it's, it's okay. Saturdays are chill streams, pretty much. Why negotiate when you can just decide? What? Oh, it's her. She's in the mirror. <laughs> Did I miss anything good? Well, okay. Look at you all fixed up. Uh, oh, righty then. Really, they are all ganging up on me. Ah, uh, yeah, punch him towards Jersey. Bop, 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 bop. Quick time. Silver bullets, shit. Whoa! You're done, Wolf. That's a pocket dimension and a half. 
Okay, fuck you, Georgie. I'd like to say it was nice knowing you. <laughs> yeah, stab each other. That's how that's how you do it. Bup, 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 bup. Freaking Harakiri. Boop! Quick time. This way. To the right. I love the Jersey Devil. This is really cool. Is he done? Okay, we're good. Help! Come on, Georgie. Ooh, shit! I know. I know. Out of a wall. That's dope. Up, 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 up. Whoa, dude. Yep. All right, full on wolf. Oh, wait, what? What's that on the bottom? Hello, what? What's happening? It's so loud. Good lord. Uh, up top. Up top. This is awesome. I love the episode so far. Did I lose them? Oh, nope. There they are. Run, Bigby, run. Hardcore parkour. I ain't missing any quick times right now. I don't have the luxury to. Fuck! What was that? Hey guys, I'm here. <laughs> oh shit, that's the. Um, yeah, let's do the window. Take him off! I can't! I ain't falling, dude. Oh, never mind. I said I wasn't falling, not getting propelled forwards. It was all according to plan, trust me. Oh, what, are you Do gonna it. run me over now? Do it! He's not moving. Keep going! Wait, was that... Should I have... Come on. Why would you go to the... Back to the pudding and pie, that makes no sense. Wait, what? What was the, the whole point of this entire chase scene in that case? That was retarded. Holy shit. And I didn't see the point in... Uh, in getting run over by the car, so that's why I moved. I don't know, as cool as that was, like that entire sequence... Now it seems kind of super pointless. Yeah, there's no point in... Actually, maybe the car, but the blood, there's no point in examining that. However, I do seem... Super in control. Like, I'm immediately back to normal. As if nothing happened. Come on! We can't stay here! Uh, uh, hang on! I need a minute. Oh, they plan on getting out quick, I see. Now, the reason I chose Georgie and not the Crooked Man... Shit. ...is because... Oh, Bigby. 
I feel like he's gonna give him up. I hope you'd come to your senses. <laughs> oh, crooked man's the one you want. But of course, you're too much of an idiot to see that. Or maybe you just like me too much to let me go. I'm taking you in, Georgie. Let's go. Oh, you gonna carry me? Please, Sheriff. Haven't you done enough? Look at him. He's dying. Vivian, why are you, you protecting him? You want to protect this guy. You know what he did. I'm not going anywhere. It isn't his fault. He's a murderer. Faith and Lily, he's the reason they're dead. Look, I know he made a few mistakes. We all have. It, what? He How is sure mistake? How those damn ribbons and then he killed them. You're wearing one yourself. Murder is not a mistake. Body, even a little knowing that man murdered. Of course it does. Those girls. So it's all my fucking fault then. I you didn't fucking. Mean. Ah, hey, Flego. You're gonna throw me to the fucking wolf too. You know I didn't have a goddamn choice. What the fuck? I did what I had to. You can't fucking blame me for that. Look. I'm Sometimes just... you just have to do what you're told. Why okay, you it, do it? Then? Explain. Explain. Then what the fuck fucking happened? America, expel him. Look, Faith and the others tried to pull a run on us. And as you can imagine, the crooked man wasn't too thrilled. But of course, the big boss didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. So he told me to take care of it. You think I don't know what that means? Either I do what he says or I'm the one getting dealt with. So I fucking killed him. And I'd do it again. Because it's not my fault. The crooked man gave the order. He told me to kill them. Oh, so and you're not responsible. He sold me out. You're still the one who pulled the trigger. Fucking Nobody re held He's your hand actually and retarded. You through with it. Ryan, believe what you want. I can tell you've made up your mind. Doesn't matter if it's fucking true or not. Go ahead and arrest me then. But it won't bring back Lily or Faith. It won't free your friend Narissa. And I'm just the sap taking the fall for the whole thing. It must be so easy being you. Just come in here and blame me for all what this shit. What do you shit. mean, George blame? Is right. George is the bad guy. It's all his fucking Oh fault. my god, you murdered people. What do you mean? I am actually gonna lose my mind. What supposed to do? You don't know what it's like, Bigby. How could you know? At the end of the day, Stop just like whining. It. Stop complaining and take responsibility for what you did. You murdered Faith and Lily. You put those fucking ribbons around their necks. You had the power to let him go, but you chose not to. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. If I freed them... What yeah. would you have me do? Kill her? Georgie, don't. It was them or Vivian. So you tell me, if Free and Lily meant she had to die... Do you still think I had a fucking choice? What are you doing? I told you! What are you talking about? This is the original. The girl with the ribbon. I'm sure you've heard the stories. Couldn't take it off. Couldn't talk about it. She used her little purple ribbon to make more of them. To keep our girls quiet. Oh, shit. To ensure absolute discretion. You promised you wouldn't. All that magic is connected to this little thing. You remove hers, and the spell's broken. They're all free. But you know what happens to her? The same thing that happened to Faith. <clears throat> So don't you come in here and tell me I fucked up. What the hell, Georgie? Yeah, kill one, we save many. We were supposed to look out for each other. It's a hard choice. I trusted you. You can't fucking blame me. You're not innocent here either. I know that. But did it have to be like this? How could you do this? I thought you cared about them. I do. Of course I do. You have to understand. Nobody was supposed to die. When we built this place, it, it was just a stupid idea. A gimmick. Discretion is our guarantee. That's how it started, anyway. This was supposed to be our place. We were going to be in charge for once, and nobody would try to control us or use us. That was the point. Then the crooked man showed up, and everything just turned to shit. So, do you get it now? Why I couldn't just... <clears throat> if you still think it's so fucking simple, then you do it. Go right ahead. Kill her then. What are you doing? Break the spell. Save the fucking day. Stop it. I told you. Sometimes all your options are shit. I'm yeah, but you're still gonna make a choice game, anyway. Georgie. I won't kill her. Don't talk about me like I'm not even here. Please. You think this is hard for you? 
My life is such a fucking burden on your conscience. Don't I get a say? It's my life. Like it was either of yours to give up in the first place. I wasn't really- Just shut up. You're right. It's your life. I know what I've done. Wait. I'm sick of everyone thinking that they can just do what they want with my life. I thought it would be different here. But it's all the fucking same. Vivian, I didn't mean- Do you think I wanted to be this person? What I did to Faith and Lily. God, this game all really of them. put some Vivian, heavy wait. moral choices on you. I have to look Gwen and Hans in the eye and pretend I don't care. I have to forget what I've done to them, what I took away from them. I look at Nerissa and I hate myself. Vivian, I can't pretend anymore. What are you doing, Vivian? Don't. Oh. Oh. Goodbye, Vivian, Georgie. no. Fuck! No, 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 no! Why'd you have to do that, Vivian? Vivian! Shit! Just... Jesus. Vivian! I didn't fucking mean it! I was just... Now come to your fucking senses and help me stop this once and for all. She did it because she couldn't live like that anymore, and yes, it was her life, it was her choice. It's still f so fucked up, but... Oh, fuck! Get up. She didn't want to carry that burden anymore. Get up! Don't think so, Bigby. I'm gonna die here. I think we both know that. Just make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. Oh, you can be sure I will. Really fuck him up for me, all right? He's gonna uh, have it worse. Uh, Don't worry. <coughs> Good. Old foundry by the river, all right? Shepherd Metalworks. He'll be there. Fucking asshole. Thank you. You wanna finish me off now? Or do you plan to kick me around a little first? Rip my limbs off one by one? That's what you want to do, right? That's not who I am. Sure it's not. No more games, all right? We both know how this ends. <laughs> Just make it quick. I know what I did. <laughs> Let's not draw this out. I couldn't. I... He still has to... What? You're just gonna leave me here? I can't do it, Georgie. I can't take another life. You selfish bastard. I'm not selfish, plus you Fuck still you. murdered Faith and Lily, so you deserve this. This is your this punishment. Is you don't get the easy way out. And if I'm gonna take another life and live with that... Like, have it on my conscience, it's not gonna be yours, so fuck you. I couldn't make that choice, I'm sorry. <laughs> Most people probably took pity on him, but 